Hey, I'm gonna make a Russian apple pie. If you've never had or heard of Russian apple pie, you're not alone. This woman who, uh, her, what's her TikTok? Russian for Americans. Um, <laughs> how do you forget that one? Uh, but anyways, so she made it. My wife sent it to me and she was like, you should make this. And I was like, I, so I made it. So I have made this before, but you know, um, we're going, we're going light on the anxieties this time because I make the rules and I can do what I want. So there. I don't really know that much about Russians. My dad was married to a Russian once. We don't really talk about it. It wasn't a great idea. She started doing this thing where she would make dinner and we weren't allowed to eat anything until my dad got home. And she was like, oh no, it's, it's a, you know, it's a Russian custom, it's a Russian custom. We were like, okay, but like, <laughs> we're hungry. <laughs> um, but so like this, this went on for probably a couple of months. That was when my dad started to get sick. And um, it was super fucked up because, you know, like my dad is my dad. Like, that's my, that's my dude right there. He ended up having uh, this episode where he was having a dream that my grandfather, who had passed away at this point, um, was telling him to wake up. And he was like, Dad, I'm leaving you alone. I'm sleeping. And he was like, boy, if you don't wake up, you're never going to wake up. And then he hit him in the dream. And my dad woke up and his chest hurt and he couldn't breathe. And he went to the hospital. And then, you know, the, the doctors were running tests on him and, you know, trying to figure out what, what was going on. Cause you know, like he thought he was having a heart attack <laughs> and they were like, no, it's, we, there's something, something else going on. So they're running all these tests. They keep him in the hospital. So he's in the hospital for like a week. Um, you know, gradually he starts getting better, all of his symptoms are clearing up, and, you know, the doctors still haven't really found exactly what was causing it, and they were like, you know, we, we want to talk to your wife, and at this point, because as soon as my dad was in the hospital and started to get better, she left, like, she packed her stuff up and left, and, <laughs> um, you know, so my dad told the doctor, he's like, well, you know, she's, she's left, like, she left me. And, um, and he's like, why, why, why do you want to talk to her? And they were like, well, the only thing that we can find that would cause the symptoms that you were having is if you're being poisoned. And so the nearest they could come up with because of how it dissipated in his system was that she had been poisoning him with antifreeze. Yeah, and as soon as he started to get better, she disappeared. Be careful when you marry. Not everyone has good intentions in your life. But this Russian apple pie, delicious. That's entertaining. Oh, okay. So, because I think it's important when making a Russian apple pie, um, we're gonna make a Moscow mule. So, I've already got some crushed ice, and we have our vodka. Um, so, it's like one and a half ounces, technically. I'm just gonna, I'm measuring ish. Somewhat. I think that's technically like a little bit more. Okay, vodka. 
and typically we'll have some little limes. I'm going to squeeze about a teaspoon of lime juice in there. I don't, but I have lime juice and I'm just going to put a little beep in there. And we're going to top it off with some ginger beer. I guess it's not like a typical um, accoutrement for a Moscow Mule, but um, I like to get them if we ever go to Bonefish, and this is how they make them, and they put the candied ginger on it, and that is my favorite part. So, I got my little candy ginger. I don't know. Egos and sugar. Now, for the truly magic part, and the part that the, the first time I made this, I was like, what? Um, you just mix the shit out of it until it turns like white and frothy. So then I'm going to add the flour like a little bit in, like I'm not mixing it all at once. Little by little. That's what I was trying to... There you go. Mix that around. Okay, yeah. So original recipe doesn't call for vanilla, but... So we got our pan. I'm just going to butter it. So you're going to put half-ish. It doesn't matter. It's all going to taste delicious. Just put the apples in the pan. We don't have to go Martha Stewart with it. I'm sorry, Martha. I was going to try. Shimmin in. Gammon. There you go. We just going to sprinkle that on there. Hell yeah. Oops, that was a lot. Dun, 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 dun. Just gonna try and cover it a little bit. Tuck our little apples in. Now we're just gonna put it in the oven for like 40 minutes and see what the fuck happens. You know what I'm ready to be done with? Fucking summer. Here's our pie. I know what you're thinking. That's not a pie. But it is. It's a Russian apple pie. And it is hot as lava, so we're gonna let it cool for a while. And then we're gonna release it into the world. It's gonna be wonderful. I think it's cooled off enough. Either that or I'm just super fucking ow. That's hot. That's how it's hot. Mm. It's so good. It's not like super sweet. Um, Cause I don't know, with like typical like American apple pie, it can be really sweet, like sweet. Um, I like it. And it pairs really great with a Moscow Mule. Hope you guys are staying sane. Um, if you have any requests for stuff that you want me to try to make, um, put, put them in the comments. And uh, otherwise, like, subscribe, tell your friends. Maybe tell your mom, but only if she's cool.